Hi guys, this is Farz and welcome back to Farzalo Z and I'm here with another new tutorial after a long long time and in this tutorial we will edit this beautiful outer portrait, we will edit and color grade this portrait. This is a very easy tutorial, this is perfect for beginners. I'll show you how to color grade this portrait uh, by applying some adjustment layers by, adjust by just simple adjustment layer. So let's do it. Okay, at first look at the picture. Uh, I think here it looks a little bit too bright so we want to uh, fix the highlights here so you can use camera raw if you are using a raw version or go to the adjustment and here you will find shadows and highlights okay make sure you have selected the more uh, show more option and enable the preview I don't want to mess with the shadows so bring it to zero and just increase the highlights uh, I think around 20% like this before and after this is the before and this is after I think this is perfect so now just press ok that's perfect and I want to change the whole color of this image uh, so uh, I want to go to the channel mixer option at first okay and select here okay let's start with the red and i think this is fine then go to the green okay make it zero here and in case of blue i think here 100 it looks fully reddish okay then come into the blue color and here uh, let's put 100 into the green and zero to the blue it's not looking right since the blending mode to lighten and now look at this look at the magic it looks really really beautiful it gives a really uh should i say cool soothing effect right it looks good so the first part is done now go to the selective color option let's start with again the red color and okay i think this is fine okay now look at this just increase or decrease it and look at the changes i'm going with minus seven in this case and magenta i don't want to mess with this and little warm look i want little warm look so here i'm going with plus 20 i think yeah plus plus 20 in case of yellow and let's go with the cyan okay so look at the senses okay i'm confused actually so here i'm going with minus 12 and for magenta i think this color looks better so here i'm going with minus i think minus 30 or 35 minus 35 looks good to me that's perfect then go to the white and and increase uh, the sign here so I'm going with plus 15 now come into the neutral and and increase the sign just a little I think plus 20 okay and magenta I think plus 5 that's good so look at this this was the before and this is after it looks good if you want you can uh, increase the vibrance here i think around 55 that looks good look at this this is the before and this is after okay i think the basic editing the basic color grading is done now let's apply a color lock of here Raise warm opposite bring it down to 10 to 15 percent i think this is fine it, it gives a little bit warm tone here that's good okay now if you want you can add a vignette effect or or okay create a new layer press b to select the brush here soft white uh, soft brush press and hold alter and select the color from your picture uh, i want the color of the leaves here 
Okay, here since the uh, is, uh, blending mode is green, make it brush a little bit bigger and just click. And look at this, it gives a very beautiful color. Press Ctrl and T to reshape like this and just look at this. Isn't it beautiful? It looks really good and it's very handy to hide any blank space. Press Ctrl and Z to copy the layer and press it on the another area. It looks really, really good to me. And it's very handy. Press enter, press Ctrl and Z again and place it on the other area. Okay. Okay, I want to add another color, so direct another layer since the blending mode is green and I'm going with this time a orange color. Uh, like this. And just click, press Ctrl and T and look at this color. It looks really beautiful. Just, I want to fill this area so you can see the little light is looking really beautiful press ctrl and z copy it and just place it here and there it looks really really good so i think this is done okay if you want you can just increase little contrast here like this the a scarp the famous s curve. okay and the final one if you want you can add a gradient oops i think in the basic not in there okay since the color here to black and here also since the style to radial select reverse and increase the scale Change the blending mode to soft light and decrease the opacity to around 40%. I think. I think I should place it beneath the uh, light. So I think this is fine. So let's see the V4 and after overall. Look at this. This was the V4 and this is after. It looks really, really good. So. This is it. Hope you love this tutorial. If you did, hit the like button, leave your comments, and don't forget to subscribe.